614, welcome back. With an emphasis on physical and mental health for young people, one local 12-year-old in South Central PA is not messing around when it comes to martial arts to reach his dreams. I mean, I wouldn't want to mess with him. No. Fox 43's Amy Lutz shares his story in this week's Health Smart. <laughs> Joshua Aguirre is no stranger to martial arts. He started taking classes when he was just four and a half. I was watching Bruce Lee and Chuck Norris movies. I started to kick all over the house. He quickly moved up with experience and rank. I got my first degree black belt at six years old, my second degree at seven, and my third degree at ten. And the now 12-year-old has the medals to prove it. So this one right here is the Indomitable Spirit Award, which I got from the AAU Nationals. He spends much of his time training here at the West Shore Academy of Martial Arts, working on his physical abilities and strength to compete. This year I have the qualifier for the Nationals in New Jersey. I have the Classic of the Caribbean in Cartagena, Colombia. I have the AAU Nationals in... Fort Lauderdale, and I have the Junior Olympics in North Carolina. At such a young age, he's already very aware of how martial arts is about much more than physical health. It also helps the mind. I always have a calm, normal, strong mental state where I feel I can do anything and I can reach my future dreams. Type. Master Vince Vergara preaches the importance of physical and mental health, saying a healthy mind, body, and spirit like Joshua's comes from years of martial arts training. A lot of kids these days are really lazy being in front of the TV, boob tube, playing video games, and they need to do something physical. I always try to push martial arts on them because there's a discipline involved in martial arts that are not seen as easily in other sports. Joshua agrees doesn't only apply to martial arts, it applies to our everyday lives. Kids being overwhelmed and not having that calm mental state, yes. it changes their whole thinking. That's why my motto, you know, never be nervous, just have fun. Come on. And he's excited to yeah. use everything he's learned each step of the way to reach his goals. So it's a whole journey and I want to continue it on to you know, reach my dreams of going to the Olympics 2028 Los Angeles. Amy Lutz, Fox 43 News. Oh, I love that we've been following his story. That's so cool. Mm -hmm. They knew who this was already. They're like, he's gotten so big. Yes, I mean, we've had him live on our show when he was like six, seven years old. Such a polite boy. Oh, he, he and still has the hair. I love his hair, and I love that he just keeps its intact. I love it. He's, he's so be great. He's running out of things to win at this point, though, because like he has won so every much. tournament. Uh, that, yeah, and yeah. he's just he's so good, so yeah. incredible. So Very far cool. from done. Uh -huh. Yeah, exactly. A lot more to come from him for sure. He's going to keep doing big things. Yep. Absolutely. <laughs>